This is Sound Off, Louisiana's premier television sports show. Coming to you from Sportsbook at Loberge Lake Charles. Here are the guys, Rick, Scooter, and Kevin. Boy, we are thrilled to be on your television screen. Yes, we are. Uh, giving you great uh, entertainment. As always, right? as always. We're going to flood you with uh, proverbial opinions, right? You like that? We have flood that. We do. You and, we, and we have those. With our opinions. We have That's those. what we do here at Sound Off. All right. Uh, Kevin Gidry, Rick Sound Normally, I'm right, uh, though. Scooter Hobbs, still on injured reserve? Yes. We'll hope to have him back in a couple we'll of weeks. We'll have Scooter back soon. Very, very well. The elder statesman, if you will. All right. Yes. Uh, Sound Off, always presented to you by our own L Club. Let me, let me share something with you. I like that. You've Rick, got I your kinda, big shot L like Club that. at yeah, LSU. I kind of like that, though, Rick. I know where you're going. President of the L Club, all that alumni, athletics. Well, we like have that. our L Club. We do. That would be the show presented by LaBear's La Casino Resort and Lundy Law. And Lundy Law. That's our I like L that. Club. There it is, right? I like that, Rick. I like that. Well, well, I'll, I'll come up with I'm a few. I'm not convert him yet. I, I am. I'm not convert him yet. I am. Uh, I like big that. story, of course, as we're coming to you later in the evening, NFL yes. draft, as you could be watching Whoa. us. If you're switching back and forth yeah. between the ABC, ESPN draft coverage and us, half the first round is already in the books, but we'll have a little fun with the time, NFL right? draft. We'll kind of tell you what we think is going to happen. You can kind of prove us wrong. All right, uh, Jalen Daniels, of course. Hey, uh, coming up later on in the show, you and I kid, are going to go back and forth about this uh, Louisiana voodoo. Moving from Lake Charles to Lafayette, and what is it a big deal? We'll, he, we'll get into how that. How long did they stay here for? A couple hours? Uh, it was a, a couple of weeks. <laughs> Will Wade kicks up a couple of big transfers for the Cowboy basketball yeah. team. We've got that on tap. Uh, and NBA playoffs, we'll touch on it with the, now that you're wearing I your swear Pelicans. I put my dark. Pelicans on, man. Come Look, on, I got a big on, question. I'm Pelicans, man. I got on, a big Pelicans. question. I'm going bought this in New Orleans, man. You're interrupting me, by the way. <laughs> uh, I got a little tidbit about Ka Caitlin Clark. Uh -oh. Think about this with Clark now out of college basketball and also Angel Reese out of women's yeah. college basketball and the big girl Cardoza. Cardoza. Uh, will the popularity no. kind of contract? Do you go see down? the superstars they have been waiting with? I don't know. Oh we'll debate God. that later Rick. on in the show. Juju, All right. Juju from USC? Rick. I'm Caitlin Clark. Come on Angel now. Angel Reese. Man. All right. The NFL Come draft, on. the early picks are done. Our show they production, are. of course, prior to the start of the NFL draft. Caleb Williams yeah. had to go number one to the Chicago he did. Bears. He did. He did. Jalen Daniels, at least, at least, if something squirrely happens, he's going to the Commanders. At least two or three, right? Yeah, he's going to the Commanders. He's Is he better to. than Caleb Williams? I think he's right up there. He is, Rick. I mean, he is just. Caleb, stuck. you know what? Let me let me now, say this. Caleb Williams this, is a, you know, when I saw him in Oklahoma, kind of kind of thinnish. Yeah. Well, let me tell you, he's he up put a bit, on Rick. some bulk at but Southern you know California. What, Rick? Can He's you, a big man. You know when you say that, and that's a good question, but you know what I look at? At that position, Rick, look at the people around you. Caleb has some superstars, bro. LSU has three. Yeah. yeah. yeah Caleb but wait, but wait, the, but the wait, Rick. Neighbors. But, but, but Rick, this dude, wide receiver, And also back, Williams had no he offensive had a hell of a, He had a he hell of a defense, too. Offensive. No, so, I mean, Rick, look at that. When you say that, that's kind of a biased question, but – Look at the people around each guy. They're, they're two Heisman trophies. They are. They're, they are. They're they are. very, very good. Will I mean, they transition to the NFL? I think they will. I think they will. I think they will. Okay, I think they I will. Think All they right. Will. Uh, Roger Goodell, the commissioner. Yeah. Uh, look, he's going to go to the podium. I think, this is my gut, I think he's going to have some, in the first round, some interesting deals and, and trades. And, because of the teams, Rick, that are picking so low. Because there's so many quarterbacks. Those are the ones that's in need, Rick. They well, are in need. Exactly. And but you got New England. There's a little smoke this week that the Patriots, once again, even though Bilicek's not there, is good, interested in trading down to get more picks and to buy. Rick, and they need a quarterback they do. big time. They do. They and do. word is, but it could all be lies. It's the number of quarterbacks that he's out there big, big time. But, Rick, you know what? The sad thing is when you go back to it, you say to yourself, how many quarterbacks that could possibly come out? Six? In the first round? Close? Five. At least okay. five. Wow. All right. All right. Wow. Mickey Loomis. I okay, think, Mickey I Loomis. I think Mickey Loomis, if, if you're watching us, could very well, the Saints have already been to the 14th pick. The greatest need is offensive tackle. Tackle. He will you go against to. his M.O. if he trades down. Yeah, he if would. he trades down. He would, Rick. He would. But, Rick, I tell you what. a ton of offensive that, tackles. And that's, and that's a need for the Saints, though. But Big I time. just keep looking at the Saints just trying to get somebody that's going to be a playmaker, game changer for them. That's all. I have that problem with them. I don't know why, but I keep I looking know you at do. that. Why uh, don't they have somebody of that stature, Rick, on that office? They could do it in free agency, though. They could, Rick. You know, we got a lot of time before July They camp. do. They do. You could pick but up a veteran who may for. get cut. You know God, what I'm saying? Dog. 
I don't think the Saints are going to be anywhere near a quarterback derby. No. Unless no. they may be I mean, in the second round, core. maybe interested in somebody. Maybe it's the Michael Pratt. The Pratt guy from Tulane. I Who know knows? what you're saying. I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just looking for Carr to be a much bigger factor for, for the Saints than what he's been. And, Rick, I know that's your boy, Rick, but he I'm He just went through a lot of injuries so, in the first year. I'm just not so a lot of injuries. Derek Carr just yet. I know you're not. And as the quarterback, Rick, you got to bring this team together, Rick. you got to show a face. you got to be the guy he that does. the Saints look to to say, you know what, when it's third and eight, we know we're going to get it because got we got you. Derek Carr. He had not show that, Rick. All the pre-draft buzz has been around yeah. all these quarterbacks. It's a lot of them. It's a lot. You colluding lot. Pratt from Tulane. It's a lot of them. You got up with the six or seven of them. It's a lot of them. Uh, you got two Heisman Trophy winners, as I mentioned earlier. Yeah. In Williams and, and Daniels coming and Daniels. into this draft. How about this for a tidbit? The quarterback heavy draft of 2021. I know which one you're talking Trevor about. Trevor Lawrence went number one. Yeah. All those other guys that were behind Lawrence, four of them. Are they with their teams? No. They are not. No, they're not, Rick. When I think about Zach it, no, they're Wilson not. Zach Wilson right. is now with Sean Payton in Denver. They're, Trey they're Lance, Trey Lance. Out is now with Dallas as a backup. He Mac is. Mac Jones is a backup well, in Jayville. Mac Jones. And Justin Fields is no Justin longer Fields. with the back. Four now, of those now, quarterbacks in that 21 draft is now with another team. Know you know what Chicago. that shows you? It is damn hard it is, to pick an NFL quarterback you know from what, the Rick? college ranks. It's not that, Rick. I got to disagree to a degree. Let me tell you what I think it is, Rick. You got five seconds you've to got, do it. You've got certain guys, Rick, that don't fit the system sometimes. Hold that thought. Head. Hold that thought. <laughs> What's not hard is getting over to the You're Max right. Bar and Grill at the National yes. in Westlake. Prime steaks and sizzling burgers off the grill, fresh seafood, and some great poor boys. Tasty cocktails and cold beer at the bar, of course. It's all at the Max Bar and Grill. Story worth telling? It starts with getaways specializing in me time. Handcrafted flavors, eager to please. Escapes to soak the day away. And rounds on a course designed by Tom Fazio. Start a story all your own. At La Berge Lake Charles. There's nothing better than a game. A great tasting Miller Lite. It's less filling than Miller Lite. Tastes great. Never understood this argument. Let it be both. Miller and Miller. I like it. What are you doing with the Johnson sofa? They had a pipe break. Water leaked all over. Really? I'm a Roto-Rooter plumber. <laughs> really? We do water cleanup, too. Really? Yeah. Call Roto-Rooter for plumbing and water cleanup. Locally owned Roto-Rooter of Southwest Louisiana does it all. Plumbing, drain cleaning, and water cleaning. We're the attorneys Southwest Louisiana has known and trusted for decades. We fought relentlessly for our clients and won. We are proud to announce a new name based on our legacy of success. We are Lundy Law. The name may be new, but our team's commitment to pursuing justice for our clients has never been stronger. From personal injury and maritime cases to insurance claims, mass tort, and civil litigation, you can count on the experienced attorneys at Lundy Law. What's bugging you? Is it termites? The season is now and they are swarming. At J&J Exterminating, we offer some very effective weapons against infestation of your home or business. Let us take care of what's bugging you. Don't wait. Contact us now for a free inspection. He's here. Anyone want a Coors Light? Oh, shoot, I forgot to play the song. I got a guy who can fix this. Sound off, coming to you from the yes. Sportsbook at La Berge, of course. You come down here, get here early. Uh, Astros baseball, uh, NBA playoffs. You got to get great food, by the way. Great food right here at the Sportsbook. Sound off. Presented to you by, that would be J&J &J Exterminating. Yes. Also presented by Roto-Rooter of Southwest Louisiana, locally owned and operated, experts in plumbing, and they do water cleanup too. All right, uh, before we dive into the Louisiana voodoo story and uh, Will Wade getting a couple of big yeah. transfers, you want to finish your thought about well, the quarterback getting you know on what? the right team in, in the right situation? In years past, Rick, you know what, when you find a quarterback, you know, you have to find quarterbacks that are that high up, Rick, that yes. are that premium quarterbacks. Rick, they've got to be in the right system that bet suits them as a quarterback. You can't have a guy that likes to get out the pocket and run and throw on, on the run, be a drop-back quarterback. It, it doesn't fit him. And those, some of the quarterbacks that you named, Rick, those were the type quarterbacks 
that had an assistant that didn't yes. fit them, Rick. Yes. Justin Fields I was a guy that had to move around. The Chicago Bears had him five steps, seven drop back. I think, That's not him. I, I got you there. I, got, I, I think what's important, maybe more so in my opinion, is the uh, Aaron Rodgers situation, even Pat Mahomes, sit a little bit. Pat Mahomes, a, a year behind uh, Alex Smith, if you get a chance you, right? to sit a but little But you know bit. what, Rick? In nowadays, in, in the reality of what we live in now, if not if you're a number one pick, they want you there. One pick, Rick. You gotta got to play, you. Rick. All right. You have to play. Uh, let's get on this Louisiana voodoo story. <laughs> uh, look, they were going to play at the Lake Charles Event Center, the, yeah, the Civic Center. The Civic Center. Uh, the first game was this weekend. Late last week, their ownership group announced that, well, we're pulling up stakes and we're moving to Lafayette. Now, it kind of blew up sports social media locally. People, some people were pointing fingers at the city of Lake Charles and yeah. the Civic Center or the Event Center for messing it up again. That's, that's social media. And Rick, you know what? But then the attorney for ASM who runs the Event Center, right. uh, uh, Gene Thibodeau, former judge, right? right who right. was their attorney, came out with a statement saying, and I'm paraphrasing, the voodoo didn't pay any money toward renting the property. Well, and you they didn't produce a, a certificate yeah, of you, insurance. You got to have a contract, it Rick, first seemed of all. Kind of simple. But you don't it, pay, you don't pay a front, you Rick, don't produce how insurance. How could you get to that point and not have that? I don't understand plan, it either. When you plan two days before this takes place. I don't get it. I, I, I don't get it either. You don't know, and, rush and I know to Judge Thibodeau, Look, But I'm just saying, I can't see how that transpired without somebody being aware of it, Rick. Uh, uh, yeah, this late in the game. Yeah. No pun intended. We're running up <laughs> yeah. to the opening of the yeah, voodoo Rick. season. And, and we don't have sudden, a contract in place. Yeah, that's a good point. Uh, you know, look, Lafayette over the decades always seems man. to beat out Lake Charles. Everything, okay? Rick. So they have a top golf. They have a Dave and Buster. Why okay. can't we have that? Don't rush to judgment in this situation in regards to the voodoo. That kind of thing. Now, look. Uh, and, and I agree with you on that, Rick. This is the Arena but, Football League. 2.0 rebooted. It is. It is. I covered the Arena League in Tampa when I was in media in Tampa. Right. Right. You played for I played the there. champion Tampa I Bay did. Storm. I did. Rick. Okay. I did. Wow. This Arena League, it's uh, not. It's yeah. not going to be the our grandfather's. You had a lot of NFL football. guys that were on my team. Yeah. That got cut and wanted to keep that was playing. High Rick. level indoor. Yeah, football. it was, Rick. But Rick, you know when you look at it, Rick. We have no entertainment here, and I'm not it taking been a good shots thing. at anybody. Uh, it would have been a great we thing. We have no entertainment. I was just in Lafayette the other day, me and my granddaughter. We went to Top Golf. I got it. You're not going to get and a Rick, Top Golf in this it's market. It's not the three level, Rick, like the but areas good. in Baton Rouge. I got it. Two level, Rick. Why can't we have that here, Rick? I'm with you. I would have liked to have seen indoor Why football. Why can't we return. have that here? I, I yes, would have liked to have we seen We have that. no entertainment, Rick. None. If it's not for McNeese University, Rick, we have nothing. Well, you got, you got the nothing. Louisiana Gumbo Gators in, in, my, uh, in, in, in baseball coming up this summer. Look, let's not kid ourselves. Lafayette's a bigger market. It is, Rick. It They're going to probably have a better chance of succeeding. I'm talking about the voodoo. But you know there. what, Rick? They are. When you say bigger market, why is that, Rick? Well, because they've got more people. But more people draw with entertainment because you got entertainment, Rick. Well, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a chicken that, and an egg thing. Yeah, it's a Rick, that. that's going to draw people, Rick, if you got entertainment. I just don't think, the, you, voodoo, I just think the, the voodoo moving to Lafayette is just that not was, that yeah. big of a deal. No, I'm sorry. I mean, I'm, I don't no, like to have seen them here. I mean, I would like, and I love football, but no, Rick, we're not going to miss a whole lot. It's not like they was going to sell us sent out okay the sports like everybody is crazy about his magnes basketball it is i mean look and it will is. wade is keeping it at the front, front and center he picked up sincere parker a yeah. tough like shooting guard out of st louis which is a, a university yeah. in st louis obviously um i mean 42 percent from three point I wow. mean, this guy is a shooter six wow. three guard and he also just just picked up earlier in the week yeah. a gentleman uh from uh arizona state six eight forward uh bryant Sanguilin, if I'm saying his name right, he's from, from Montreal. Yeah. 6'8", uh, spent some time at Tulsa and then Arizona State. So he's bringing in what Rick, he, he does what he does, Rick. Okay. Parker out of St. Louis averaged about, only played 16 games, had some injury problems. He's not going to replace a Shahada no, Wells. No, he's not. You cannot replace a Wells. No. But that, he'll, he'll Wells plug, is just a special, he'll plug special guy, some man. Some of the things that he Wells will. did. Rick, I was just sitting down thinking the other day at my house. Just looking and thinking. Tell me what you think. Yeah. Will Wade's hot right now. Yes, he is. Why not have an exhibition game at Calcasieu Parish place out there, Burton Coliseum? Exhibition game with who? Mm -hmm. Could you maybe have one with like an LSU? 
Why would you want to put it at Burton Coliseum when nobody more? wants to go out there? But you got more go seats. Yeah, I know, but you know, you got twice not, the seats. Cowboy, you got twice Cowboys the seats basketball there. is but never going to play no, anywhere in no, this no, area no. outside I'm, of the I'm saying Legacy one game. Center. I'm saying one. Never going to happen. One game. Never going to happen. Because you can't put the number of bodies that would probably go to that game in that place. Are you talking about your alma mater, I'm LSU, just, coming I'm here just to saying, play against Will Wade? No, I mean an exhibition game. In a, not even in an exhibition game. I mean, wouldn't that wouldn't that be something? Scott Woodard really? would laugh you out of the Scott room. Woodard, that we're ain't not gonna, gonna go. We're not gonna go to Baton Rouge. Oh no, my it's not gosh! But wait, think about it. I'm Never just saying. The next, remember some years past, they was gonna have an exhibition game there. The Pelicans was gonna play somebody. Right or wrong? I don't remember right it, but oh yeah, when I was on the police jury, okay. we almost had a contract, Rick. Okay. I'm just saying, never Rick, gonna happen. for entertainment, Rick, we've got to bring something to Lake Charles, man. All right, let me, LSU baseball comes here and play. All right, valid. We're running out of time. <laughs> Will Wade's trying to fill out his schedule. He does have a game against Mississippi yes, State he does. next fall yes, he does. in a neutral yes, he does. site. They're going to play in Tupelo of all Tupelo. places. Tupelo. Home but of no. who? Home of who? Tupelo. Tupelo. Um, come the on, King. Now, the King. Elvis. Come on now. God, dog. Elvis, man. Come we gotta, on we got to hit the break. We're coming right back to yes. the sports book. Stay right there. We're the attorneys Southwest Louisiana has known and trusted for decades. We fought relentlessly for our clients and won. We are proud to announce a new name based on our legacy of success. We are Lundy Law. The name may be new, but our team's commitment to pursuing justice for our clients has never been stronger. From personal injury and maritime cases to insurance claims, mass tort, and civil litigation, you can count on the experienced attorneys at Lundy Law. J&J Exterminating is here for you with our water damage sanitation treatments and wood protective bore treatments. There is no charge for home evaluations. Contact your local J&J Exterminating, Exterminating professional. Yeah. Hey mister, are you a roto rooter plumber? Guilty. Did you fix what flooded my house? I sure did. Toilet overflow? Nope. Pipe break? Getting warmer. Bust the water heater? Nailed it. How long can you hold your breath? Is that your real hair? What's the birds and the bees? Do you know where my grandma is? You know, I don't know. What's next? Wrapping up the water cleanup. You do that too? We do both. Fair enough. Call Roto-Rooter for plumbing and water cleanup. Yeah, we do both. Locally owned Roto-Rooter of Southwest Louisiana does it all. Plumbing, drain cleaning, and water cleanup. There's nothing better than a game. A great tasting Miller Lite. It's less filling, Miller Lite. Tastes great. Never understood this argument. Let it be both. Miller and Miller. I like it. What's bugging you? Is it termites? The season is now and they are swarming. At J&J Exterminating, we offer some very effective weapons against infestation of your home or business. Let us take care of what's bugging you. Don't wait. Contact us now for a free inspection. Thanks for hanging with the boys here at Sound Off coming yes. to you from the sports book at La Berge. Uh, before we get into my big question about women's basketball and the popular popularity thereof, LSU baseball. Uh, yeah. They broke the streak. They got they an gotta, SEC they series win. win. But they've been struggling over Missouri. Rick. Rick, they have been struggling, Rick. They finally won a series. The hole might be just too deep to come out. Uh, I don't know. This is baseball. Anything can happen, but they won a series. Right. Yeah, the defending national champs. They got a lot of pressure. I get it, but they they won a series. Uh, and the Cow the uh, Magnus Cowboys, Justin Hill, you know, yeah. has they look. They're still on the lower end. They are the bottom, but they're they're kind of coming around a little bit. Uh, this coming weekend, it's funny to kind of flip the script, if you will. McNeese and Southeastern in yeah. baseball were always near the top. They are. Well, now they're both kind of here, yeah. and they're playing this weekend at the Joe. It's so not going to have the same appeal, you know, but you know, when we talk, still gotta to the tournament. When we talk Anything to can happen Hill, to get to yeah, the when tournament. When we talk to Coach Hill, I think some time back, you know, is the team really that young? They're young in spots. They have a lot of experience, but he he sat right here and said, "Look, I've got some yeah. juniors and seniors, but they don't have a lot of time on the field. Yeah, yeah. you know, experience on the because field." Because we thought there was going to be an uprise in what he was doing with the getting the tournament and the Magnus baseball. Right, you know? Look, here, here's the premise: uh, women's college basketball. Yes, every they should. They should really appreciate what Caitlin Clark did for women's college basketball. Every, I mean, without a national title, by the way. Yeah. Without a national title, yeah. what she did, the last four years. Um, guys, I heard this, and I, I did some research on it. She was picked number one. I think it was last week. Did you one see by her Indiana salary? Beaver. Did y'all see her salary based on what she's making? Two eighty, three hundred. No, y'all, y'all gonna laugh. Her first year, she's making seventy-three thousand. 
Her second year, she's making 89. Yeah. Her third year, she's making 110. She's got enough. Look it up on the She's going to get website. paid. That is crazy. In the first. That is crazy. The first day of Caitlin Clark being the top pick of the fever in Indiana, they sold more shirts and merchandise yeah. than the Dallas Cowboys sold all last year. Yeah. America's team in the NFL. Caitlin Clark going number one to well, Indiana. Well, Nike, Nike, Think Nike just cut merchant. her deal. Nike just cut her deal. With, when I, with the I, I Kobe Bryant that she I, wears, I poked around and that. Okay, so that sets the stage of her immense popularity. It does. She's gone out of college basketball. It does. Angel Reese went number seven to yeah. the Chicago Sky. How right? does her and Cordova go to the same team? Was somebody sleeping? Was hey, somebody sleeping? Angel Reese is happy about that. But they went to the same all team, these, man. All these stars, Kevin, I. Rick, let me tell I you something. I think women's Rick, college basketball is on solid ground, Rick, but it's they're going to come Rick, down to earth. This I'm, is Rick, Caitlin Clark Caitlin and Clark, Angel Reese. Caitlin they're Clark gone. did that. But, Rick, do you see the players they have? Have you seen USC Juju? This girl will be – you will, you will not be no hearing about Caitlin, Caitlin Clark. You won't be hearing about Caitlin Clark in the next two years, oh, I promise you. Oh, you're crazy. Rick, you realize, you're crazy. You realize how good this girl is? She's a freshman, Rick. I saw her play. Rick, she's a freshman. I know she's a freshman. Look at the two freshmen South Carolina have, Rick. The Joyce and I think the, the – um, the Christie girl. Rick, they are freshmen. They beat LSU by themselves. I'm not down on women's college. I'm not. Rick, I think women's basketball I mean, look, future looks great. I, I, it I looks it great, too. man. I'm just saying. It looks great. The TV ratings, yes. that's what it's judged but on. But, Rick. They're going to come down. But, Rick. They're going to come Kaylin down. Kaitlyn Clark had to be that. Kaitlyn Clark, because she had big moments, Rick. These girls are freshmen. She set the you NCAA scoring record. You guys record. did not hear about Kaitlyn Clark as a freshman. She stayed there for no, four years. Four years. Come on, look at these girls that's coming up, Rick. But sophomore, junior, I'm senior, senior we did. But that's what I'm saying, Rick. Look at these girls that's coming up, Rick. Caitlin They're going to be superstars, man. She, she tweaked the sports psyche like a Michael Jordan, mm -hmm. like a Kobe Bryant. She's uh, you've Magic never seen Johnson. A female. That's how big she was. You, you have you know, seen females in the LSU's had some hell of a women's basketball yeah. players oh, come out of there. Oh my God! But Caitlin Clark, at a time when women sports needed her the most, Rick. She was there. And they said, you know what? We better take this and run because it's not going to happen for a while. It isn't. But I, I it hope was, it continues. It, it was like thunder. It was just like lightning in the bottle, Rick. Mark my words. That's what it was, Rick. Mark but my I tell words. You, look at some the of the people that they got coming up. are going to contract. So Rick, they're going to contract. They may, but Rick, you know what? I think with the stars that's coming up, if we'll those see. kids start shining, Rick, it's going to be a bright day for women's speaking, basketball. Speaking of media I'm telling you. buzz. Uh -oh. you know, Here we is, go. I hate when you do that. Well, Here we I'm go. Just, all right. Bill Belichick won six <laughs> Super Bowls. 20 years, he gets fired yeah. by the Patriots. Well, he was, a, what was Robert Kraft? Can, was that just two old men getting bitter with each other? Probably, probably. Reports are that Robert Kraft had a conversation with Falcons owner Arthur Blank. That was wrong said, what he did. Rick, that was wrong, Rick. Reports got out. You're going to salt on that man. I know where you're going with this. I know. Rick, that said, was wrong, Rick. Told Blank, How unclassy don't trust him. Bill Belichick That's to what run he said. your Falcons team. That's what he said. And the Falcons passed but on him. But he won you six. He did. <laughs> he did. <laughs> Bill Belichick, there was what? Six, seven jobs open last Rick. all season? He didn't get any. But you he know why? really any interest. Kraft is mad at him because he's not there. That's He's mad that's because he whole, let Tom Brady leave. Yeah, he and Tom Brady. Whole, Kraft. It did. Right. It did. It did. So Bill Belichick goes on a little media tour of his own he last week. And he don't know to do that. And he don't know to do that, Rick. What shocked my rear end was Bill Belichick has been a jerk to the media uh, for 20 years. He's not a media guy, Rick. Oh, but but he but 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 he's but, not a media guy, Rick. He wants to use the media for his purposes. He goes on McAfee and he. He, he chucks Rick it up, to bash him. Rick jokes, to bash him now. showing his good side, all because he wants to show that he can be the, the lovable guy, the more understanding, the more open guy to, for next year for NFL owners. I, I didn't like it at all. I thought it was this, disingenuous. Let me I, you, this. you know, he's a jerk to the media for 20 years, Stop and when it, it suits Rick. his purposes, he goes on the McAfee show and just starts being all, let uh, me, you know. Let me ask you this, Rick. I just... If you won six world champions, does it matter? <laughs> Apparently, it does matter. Rick, nobody gave him a Rick, job. Nobody gave Rick, him an offer. But the thing is, Rick, everybody knows that he wants to be in charge. Some people and some owners, some GMs don't want to give that power no, up. No, I, I did not. We, two months ago, 
when Look, this started, somebody when this made started a joke floating around when when his job was on the line when he kept losing at New England. Yeah. Didn't I sit here and I asked you and Hobbs? I said, if the Saints fired Dennis Allen, would I take Bill Belichick? You and said I no. said, hell no. He no. said no. You know the perfect hell place no, for him I don't to want go. That man on that, in the that, perfect in that place for him to go. You know where we'd be? Dallas. Dallas, if Jerry Jones could handle him, maybe. <laughs> Dallas would be the perfect place for Bill Belichick to go, man. Maybe, oh maybe the God. New York Dallas. Giants. Oh. But Rick, let I don't me just know. say this. I, I don't know. You and I both know Bill Belichick will end up with a job. He, okay? That's all he wants is to break Don Shula's all-time NFL wins record. That's all he really that. wants. You're not both, he will end up with a job. Probably. And you know, what, and you know what, what's sad when you look at it? Those guys have been together for a long time, Robert Kraft and Bill Belichick. What would make Robert Kraft lure himself Lure himself to tell the guy, the owner for the Atlanta Falcons. Set it off the record, but reports get out, doesn't it? All right, that's going to do it for us. We had a great time, man. God, Always dog, thrilled I to have you here. Time's gone it. already. We'll see you next time right here at Sound Off. Hey, mister, did you fix what flooded my house? Sure did. Bust the water heater? Nailed it. What's next? Wrapping up the water cleanup. You do that too? We do both. Fair enough. Call roto Rooter for plumbing and water cleanup. Yeah, we do both. Locally owned Rotor Rooter of Southwest Louisiana does it all. Plumbing, drain cleaning, and water cleanup. If it's a story worth telling, it starts with getaways specializing in me time. Handcrafted flavors eager to please. Escapes to soak the day away. And rounds on a course designed by Tom Fazio. Start a story all your own at LaBerge Lake Charles. There's nothing better than a game. A great tasting Miller Lite. It's less filling than Miller Lite. Tastes great. Never understood this argument. Let it be both. Miller and Miller. I like it.